Ladies and gentlemen, while it's still up for debate, we have now found ourselves the winner of the most iconic video game character award. A character that is a trailblazer in the third person action adventure genre. A character that can be characterized as an OG. Character, character, and the winner goes to, ladies and gentlemen, Laura Croft. The Tomb Raider. Y'all, I apologize. Y'all know I always be trying to make some type of intro and what was that? But no, all seriousness, Laura Croft has been crowned the most iconic video game character. Now, granted, this poll was like only in the UK and it was only 4,000 people. So to be honest, we know that can't be a fact. Now she is a iconic character. But if I had to choose of all time, I would have to give it to an even more OG like Mario, Sonic, Pac-Man. They're, they're the big three. But if you were to give a specific genre like the third person actually adventure mystery puzzles all of that type of stuff yeah for sure Laura Croft then next up is the homie damn Nathan Drake Nathan Drake bro I'm sorry I brain fart but anyway we are here to play a lot of Tomb Raider games all in one video if y'all been keeping up with our community tabs and just watching other videos on my channel you might have known that I've been talking about some of the games that we're going to be playing a lot that y'all suggested one being the Tomb Raider franchise now y'all know that there is a lot of Tomb Raider games I actually have every game on PC but we do not have time to play all of them man so what I decided to do all the OG Tomb Raider games the first trilogy and that second trilogy I'm going to play here today of of course we're not going to be the be all of them but i'm just going to be messing around skimming around looking at some recaps so i can understand the story then after that we will actually play the latest trilogy and then we can be ready for the upcoming tomb raider game that's actively in development as we speak it might take a while but at least it's being worked on so with that being said Hey man, what's going on man? This your boy Kage SMG back with another video man and today you can tell by the thumbnail, you can tell by the title exactly what's going on man. We playing Tomb Raider Remastered. I bought this on PlayStation man. Like I said, I have every game on PC but I wanted to get the remastered. Maybe it'll be a little better. Uh, It was $30. It wasn't on sale. Shout out Crystal Dynamics. Embracer. Yeah. Hopefully this is worth it. I never played the OGs. I seen gameplay. I actually played a little bit on my PC but it wasn't enough to like get into it but tomb raider okay so this is only the first three i know this version of laura croft had a lot of games but we see, are we in space what let's start with the first one laura's home is that is that like chapter one or something game okay new game what is laura's home then what the freak oh my gosh these graphics even though this is like apparently updated well it's remastered it's not a remake um, excuse me? Hold on, Laura. See, Laura okay, is a. Mind. I'll take you on a guided tour. Don't mind if I do. I'm, I'm just the like. Pad to go into the music room. The music room? Why? I do know the controls were. Okay, hold on, bruh. You need more of a tutorial. How do I like pause? Ah! Bro, pause button. What the freak? Uh, this is how them things are pointy. No way. This is how it's so they they changed a lot. It's still a remaster, but it's updated for sure. Okay, so it looks like I can't walk back. Going back is a step back. She said going to the music room. We can Well, okay, circle is a little roll. Jump with square. So X is nothing. Okay. Um music room. Okay, I see a piano. Got you. Okay. Uh, let's do some tumbling. Some Press tumbling. The jump button. Okay. I'll press it again and quickly press one of the directions and I'll jump that way. One of Excuse me? You tell me to do that with no no hint. Oh, I got you. Oh god, okay. Oh, that's crazy. Can I go back? Ugh! Okay, Laura. And we can go forward. Okay. All right. I'm in a music room now. Are we doing anything? So I have to actually rotate before I can That's strange. Hold on. What's the actual controls though cuz Change you know, tank controls. What does that mean? Modern controls, tank controls, modern. Hold on, what's modern? Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna have to do modern. Modern, I can use my analog. Jump with X. We still roll with circle. Square is nothing. What the freak? I start holding square and I walk. What the? Let's just start a new game. I'm, I'm a. Okay. Listen. Los Alamos, New Mexico. Yep. Look at that damn snake, bro. Bro. What? Excuse me? Is that a UFO? Don't tell me I'm just gonna automatically start in the tomb, bro. Did I cause that explosion? Ain't no way, bro. That's really a UFO. Bro, what? 
That's bro. What Imperial Hotel? Why is it so dark? They must then update the cutscenes. What's a man got to do to get that kind of attention from you, bro? Hard to say exactly. Oh my you gosh. Be doing fine. Well, they go to glasses. That's why I had to the put them on, bro. You already know. It, won't you? Huh? No, Miss Jacqueline Natla does. From Who? Natla Technology. Man, can I you skip know. this? I can actually skip it. We we not here to play all of these though, so I wasn't expecting it to skip that fast. And we in the snowy mountains. Is that Raiden? What the huh? Oh, that's Kung Lao. Okay, I see you, my boy. Skip this too. Uh oh. Oh snap. Okay. We're in the snow dunes. I probably shouldn't have skipped. We saw we was on a snow mountain though, so you know. So do I still how do I do my directional? <laughs> Whoa, oh, chill! Chill, put no freaking way. Okay. You point me up here, I'll take it. I'll I'll take it, I guess. Um, can you let me jump, Lord, please? There you go. Stiff eye jump. All right. Um, we're doing it, y'all. All these are the same. So a roll is kind of like rolling me in that direction. We got ooh. Okay. Okay, so I just gotta hold it. Infinite ammo, it seems. All right, I'll, I'll take it. So confused. Are y'all? Hey, hey, get me! No freaking way! I got dual Glocks. Where are we at? The Bat Cave? Yep, just taking it one step at a time. Doing my Laura Croft thing, bro. She stay in these mugs. It's getting too dark. I'm a little nervous. Okay. Okay. I see the light shining. Oh, this is my exit route. I'm heading out this way for sure. Maybe that was a lie. Yo, then, bro, what? I see a hole down there. I don't know about that. Might get me trapped. Let's look around. I don't even know how long I'm going to stay on each game. I just wanted to at least get some action in. I guess I already shot some bats, but are we going down here? There's a death sentence. I'm going to do it anyway, yeah? What, what, what button is that? Y'all got to know, uh, triangle. Okay, triangle is our action button. Hey, I am nervous. What's happening? Get him out of here. I see you. Okay, uh, okay, these are crystals made from the Himalayas. All right, heading through. Ponytail still swinging. That means I'm still doing my thing in. If you don't know what I'm saying in, then you not under staying in, because I don't be staying in the Motel 6. I gotta, uh, <laughs> I'm not a rapper. Did I just see movement down here? Oh my gosh! What the freak? Oh, no! Get back right now, Linda! You can't be making them sounds. Okay, roll. Yep. Stay, get away from me. Get away from me. That's the thing about Laura, bro. She gon' bust. Oh, yeah. Stop right now. Woo! That was terrifying. Okay, I see a bridge up here. Um, I guess I could switch games after each death, but I'm kind of doing my thing, bro. And what is this, bro? I rebuke it. So if I head on bridge, I can cut across. I'm guessing we're going to that bridge. You know what I'm saying? I'm just burning bridges and stuff. Okay, we're on this one. Just gonna keep it up. You know what I'm saying? Just keep it up. Heading through here. Oh, yeah, I'm making big pro mm, I don't like that, bro. That's the thing about Tomb Raider and Uncharted. When I get to a room like this, I know a puzzle is on the way, bro. Maybe I'm just making big jumps, though. Hold on. Hold on. Check me out, y'all. I can't sprint. Oh! What's that sound? I'm so nervous, bro. This is like one of them indie backroom games. <laughs> Let me stop hating on a classic. All right, we going in. Get your dual pistols out. Huh? Why? What? Stop right now. Okay. I didn't know she had the tunes like that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What you want to do? Ain't no freaking way. Come here right now, scoundrel. Yeah. Damn, jolly good show, me boy. Hey, this sound like, damn, I don't even know. McBath? Bop? Where am I going now, bro? I think this is another lever. I'm going to press it. It was, tr yep, triangle is my uh, press button. Got you. Okay, and the door is open. I don't like this. I still don't know how to dodge. Like, you know what I'm saying? Remember she said I can jump and go into the direction? I can't do that on modern controls. If we have a boss, I'm going to the next one, bro, because we going to face the boss. Oh, shit. Damn. Stop. Mm -mm, not me. Hold on. Maybe we won't have a boss. It's getting cut. Oh, this is our way out. I th oh my gosh. Yeah, get hit in your neck. I know y'all heard him scream. That almost took me out. I guess I'm heading down here anyway. What the freak? This music is so out of place, but it, it works though. Um, okay. Maybe we got to take underground passageways like uh, Harriet. Bro, I'm tired of no freaking way. Can I shoot these? How, uh, how do I, you know what I'm saying? How do I, what do I do here? Two hours later. Man, forget this. Tomb Raider 2. So every game has a home. Let's just go here. Let's just do all the home ones and play a little bit of the first mission, I guess. Welcome back. After that grueling business last year, I decided to build this assault course to hone my skills. And Alfred. Alfred. Oh. What happened? 
I know that ain't out for y'all, but I sure don't remember his name. I, I'm sorry. Cuz I think it's time for you to retire. But I seen Angelina Jolie's movies, but I never, you know, oh, bro, did it switch my controls back? It didn't. Okay. Oh. Mm -mm, not me. Come on. You ain't. Yep, yep, yep. Laura, stop. Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. How the freak am I? Ooh. Did I do that with trigger? Okay. Oh, gosh. Bruh. Oh, it still counts. So if I hold trigger, I can climb. Can climb up this wall. Just okay. Just walk up to it and hold down the action button. Okay, so... And then use the direction buttons to climb up, down, and side to side. Okay. She was freestyling a little. She said up, down, and side to side. I eat chicken and pork rinds. <laughs> Let's start the daggone game. Okay. Bunch of eagles or bird. Damn, but... See, that's the thing. She be dealing with mystical and mythicals. That mug had snake eyes. He had people on a stake. That new Tomb Raider game, because I think it's Unreal Engine 5. And if y'all remember with um, Marvel 1943, that trailer, <laughs> Laura Fender, you know what I'm saying? Damn, not TN. What happened to your eye? It's over. Oh, he's still alive. Wait a minute. Is that your dragon? You the Fire Lord? I guess not. That's the dragon from Shrek, bro. You don't even count. Okay, so now we in uh England. What the freak? We just okay. I shouldn't have skipped the cutscene. Got you. I'm not worried. <gasps> okay, this scared the mess out of me. Why is that my helicopter? I skipped cutscene. I don't know. Um, I'm assuming. Okay, we're trying to get out of there or get, or get out of here. Okay, we got smooth water. Okay, can we can swim? Yep. What does it look like in the OG? Like this. That's a damn tiger. Stop. No way I'm about to die. No way I'm. Get him out of here, Tony. I know your government, bro. He tried to pull up on me like I don't know him. Like I don't eat his flakes. Like ah! like his um to eat somebody flake is crazy. Okay, so I dived in. I got a, a drowning meter. What exactly am I doing though? You know? What's the meaning of this? Laura, can you tell me? Ah! Look at man, them things that pull myself up. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Oh, gosh. Oh, my. Come on, bro. I'm going to go to the third game. You better stop. I'm definitely going to have to look at, like, plots, bro, because I don't know what's going on. I'm just playing these mugs. I'm skipping cutscenes. I just wanted to get a feel for the OG before we step into the new, which is honestly going to be an OG by the time the new one comes out, bro. Let's be on. Ooh, we made it. Okay. Jump up here. Yep. Hold on. Are we going to be able to make it, you know? I feel like I'm going to slide down, bro. I do not want to risk that unless. Hold on. Okay, this is so weird. Try to just walk. Okay, I didn't mean to get all up in you. Mm. Just like that, yep. Now, we can proceed. Okay, I'm doing my thug dizzle. I actually think we gotta make it over there. Oh gosh. She got big leaps. Okay, that'll do, that'll do. And now, come on, why do you jump in like face first? I can't just climb this? Okay, so if I go up to it and just hold trigger, she kind of jumps to the ledge. I guess if it's, it's tall enough, we can, we can do that. How am I? Bro, what the freak? What kind of form is that? All right, y'all. I paid $30 for this. And listen, I ain't even hating. It's a classic, but like, you feel me? Okay. I couldn't make that jump. You want to have all them legs and you can't make that leap. I know she only got two legs, but they, they lethal. They should have made her have like a frog superpower because... Ooh. I didn't even try to do that. Running off. Let me try it again. Hang on to a ledge if I'm holding R2 while I'm running off. That's going to come in handy. It got to be this. Mm. Okay, hold up. Hold up. Maybe I just had to wheel myself. Here we go. Hold on. Now the door is open. This is what I do. I raid tombs. I survive and I just be the best uh uh waifu. I hate using that word, bro. What the freak? Is there something in the corner you need? I thought it was a turret. Get back. Are you attacking me? There's no way. What did I do to deserve attack by eagle? Or whatever that is. I don't like this gang, bro. Oh, man. I'm gonna need a key. No. Um. No. 
Okay, jeez. Why are you so rude for? That's why I'm leaving your game. You ain't gonna say no to me like that. No. Tomb Raider 3. Welcome back to my humble abode. Okay. Feel free to take a look around. I'm doing that, Laura. Don't don't try to talk nice to me now. You being so rude talking about no. Like, stop. This is actually very familiar to the movies and the houses on... Uh, I did play a little bit of the second new trilogy, Underworld M Anniversary and all that. I think I own Underworld on Xbox. If you want to look around... Press and hold the look button. The then look press in the button. Direction you want to look. I don't know. Okay, this is the look button. Uh, analog, right analog. Click it in. Got you. They go Alfred again. You need to give it up, sir. You build like the penguin. All you need is a top hat and a glass eye, or a, a glass, a, a you know. Okay, so now we're in space. The, the the cover for the third game did look like a satellite or something was crashing. That's a humongous uh firefly. Yep. They go a frog, of course, cause Laura Croft got frog legs. We skipping cutscenes though. Okay, yeah. Oh, yeah, we sliding. Oh, yeah, we sliding. Hold up. Okay, I know about this. I'm sliding too. St <gasps> oh my gosh. Why did I just jump straight up? You're supposed to go forward if you're sliding like this. Don't just jump up. Come on. Come on. Yep. All right. All right, I'll take it. Do I got any other fits? I'm pretty sure I do, but you we got a photo mode. No, wait, we do got outfits. Hold up, classic two. Okay, just these training, training to my wetsuit. Hold on, bomber. Ugh, this is a classic right here. And that's another thing. I hope we get more iconic suits for the new game. You know what I'm saying? Like the Survivor Trilogy had them. You know what I'm saying? I actually think they had some of the pixelated versions or classic pixelated because everything is pixelated. Be you got to stop playing with me. Cat suit. Oh, man. This is crazy. Classic one. I need it. What's that bathrobe? Let's continue. Uh oh. Oh, snap. The music started. It's a finna go down. It's a finna go down. Jump in here. You're at Oh, okay. It's over. Why don't they let me know if it was quicksand or not? I'm... If you... Dude. Oh, my gosh. I was right there by the edge, and I just couldn't do nothing. I mean, I know I couldn't jump in quicksand, but, like, listen. Hey, on a scale of 1 to 10, how 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 good do y'all think I would be surviving out here on my own? Be honest, bro. I think I'm going to smove 11.5. I'm going to make it out of here. Stop the cap. I need to, you know what I'm saying, get my survival skills up, bro. I'm quick to shank somebody. I'm good with the weapons, but actually, you know, being out, like food, you know what I'm saying, and enemies, I'm not worried about. It. But it's the animals, bro. And I know I said I'm good with food, but I'm talking about fruits. And if I can't find a tree, I'm going I'm to go for a little, you know, coyote, you know what I'm saying? Maybe. Are they poisonous? No, I'm probably going to die. I need to get the training. Why won't it let me out of here? I paid 30. Listen, I'm not going to say it was a waste of cash, but you know, this video better do well. And I ain't even trying to hate on Laura. I love Tomb Raider and Laura Croft, but we got to get through these games, bro. She got a lot of games in this OG trilogy. I'm only going to be playing these three, but we got to get to the other three. And then after that, I do want to try and find like a, a lore video so I can just be in the know about everything because I never really studied, I guess, everything about Laura Croft because I know that new game is actually said they're going to unify the OG trilogy and the Survivor trilogy. So it's like they're going to be blending all of uh, Laura's best qualities, I guess, and making it into this new trilogy, I guess. So I'm excited for that. You could tell by that picture. She's wearing the classic fit again. Maybe we're going to get more into that classic uh, Laura, but add on some of her traits from the Survivor trilogy. So I think that's going to be a cool Laura. So with that being said, Tomb Raider Legend. We are now over on the Xbox. I got these other games up here, man. I was gonna play them on PC, but I couldn't make it like a Windows version so I could drag it over to my other uh, monitor, man. So I had to drop a smooth 40. But the thing about these games, I know these are fire. You know what I'm saying? Look, hey, off rip, we got a whole nother, you know what I'm saying, type of feeling, a Crystal Dynamics game. <laughs> Hold on, bro. Listen, that's that Laura Cross. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. See, we didn't need we didn't have this in the Survivor trilogy. So I hope in this new uh game she can be kind of cool again. Like Laura in the Survivor trilogy, she was she was like that, you know what I'm saying? She was a survivor. But this Laura, she had the extra finesse to her, bro. Tomb Raider legend. All right. Um Croft man. And that's another thing. We couldn't do that in a Survivor trilogy. Why did they take that out? I didn't even know that was something we could do. Go into the manor. All right, then, bro. You see that walk? She's ready to up the stick. Bro, is that big back? No way. He's standing up straight. See, like, I don't even know your name. And I know I know this character, but I, it's going to be Alfred until I know that. You look kind of creepy. All right, y'all. We are here. Who is that back there, bro? 
is this that one guy uh, uh from the survivor trilogy he's just uh different because it's as you know before i can't remember nobody name except for laura croft i definitely need to watch a lore video i know the survivor trilogy is a whole nother you know universe but i still want to be in the know just in case there's some easter eggs and stuff because i played the first survivor game 2013 and then i played like half of the second one and i barely touched the third one so i'm still fairly new to tomb raider but i know enough to like the character i just i'd be forgetting stuff y'all know this how do i whoa okay that's new okay uh we got stuff we can mess with this is still our look button it seems okay um triggers b okay b is our crouch right got a little crouch you see i'm posing like spider-man bolivia tinka wee wee okay she heard a rumor a, a rumor so yeah this, she was just going out finding like artifacts i know her dad was a a, a, a searcher a researcher right but then some of the the the, the trilogy she be having issues with the dad but then some of them she just be going to finish his work after he passed right because i know in the tomb raider movie angelina jolie tomb raider her dad was no hold on doesn't mean they're not real that's little laura that is very true but perhaps they don't wish to be found uh oh heard they're rather fierce Yet oh man fierce, they probably don't like being so cold all the time I nah they look like they might kill you You'll never have to be cold my lara it you is to be See, this is the lore I need to, you know, re re remember. Cause, Look. oh man, oh man, oh man. She she just been going through that toughness as a little girl. I mean, damn, damn. Your mama about to get folded. Buckle up. Hold on, nah, nah, nah. Cause I'm not finna say buckle up like Meek Mill. What's going on? I said that in the same cadence as get up. I'm not nah. Listen, y'all. Y'all know I'm into it. Oh, man. Oh, man. She said she don't want to. I was finna skip the cutscene. I'm gonna skip it out to... What happened? She, she's the little girl that's the little, little girl of steel. Like, she survived 16 years later. Like, what the freak? I think you forgot your gear on oh, my gosh. Maybe that turned her into the oh, lore we know today. Okay, got my gats. I skipped cutscene. Y'all know this. Uh. A big rock. Here go one. <laughs> what the freak? Why? Why do we need to do that to that little boulder? First game outside of the OG games, man. You can see the improvements. We looking crazy. I doubt we gonna get an outfit like this again in a new one, but I mean, I wouldn't mind it. You know what I'm saying? They, they would be paying homage to the OGs. Diving in. Don't go chasing water. Oh, oh. That was lovely. Thank you. I've been singing since two. Do me a favor and check your PDA. PDA. Oh, I can do that. It still works. If that's yeah, we didn't have. Do. Yeah. Cool. They said it was waterproof. You should be able to swim with it, no problem. I guess since the survivor Laura was, it's a new Laura. She was like kind of learning everything again. We didn't have all of this because I mean, like, did she even have? Don't she? This game got like, yeah, binoculars and stuff. Like, did we have any of this? I feel like this lore is just like way cooler, but survival lore was a little bit more savage, I believe. Oh, I'm already knowing. You can tell you can climb it because it looks different. And it's a different texture from everything else. I was a game developer. Just taking it one step at a time. Ooh. Oh, that's a rope. Got you. Come on now. I know about swinging. Oh, yeah. Oops. What did I do? Hey, what did I do? I can't. Okay. We in. We, well, I about to go. Don't worry about my grammar. Okay. Flashlight. I got you. How much would y'all need to be paid to go through a dark, you know, tomb like this, bro? Unless I really got the motivation to do it. Like, it's, it's a cause that I'm, you know, really want to do. I'm not doing this for nothing, bro. Turn that light off. Yep. Look, it got a battery. Okay, we are going up here. I'm doing this for real. Deep breath, sip. This will be a long trip otherwise. See, as, as the... What the fuck? Are you serious? <laughs> All right, y'all, we back. My freaking power just went out for like two hours. I'm coming back to finish this video up though, bro. I actually found some uh, lore videos. They were long though, but I found some good looking ones. I just don't know if I should add them on to the end of this video or make a separate one because I know I'm not doing much in these games. I'm like barely getting through the introduction. I just wanted to get a feel for them, a look for them. Okay, yeah, just go around. I don't even know why I tried to jump earlier. Okay, move. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. Like this trilogy, the Legend trilogy, I would play. But that would just add on to everything else we got to do, man. That's why I'm just going to make these like little short recap. Not even recap, but just messing around with the games. Am I heading up through the... Okay. I thought the current was going... <gasps> ah! That was too close. 
That was way too close, Buster. I don't know why I'm getting mad at him. He didn't know. Well, he might have. You know, they might have been trying to sabotage me. I don't know about this. Uh huh. Just like that, smooth like butter. I, oop, I want to know, like, uh, more for outfits because I don't even think I seen this one. Copy. You know? I'm then here, that. But I don't see no climber. Yeah, well, I can't shoot on sight if I can't see nobody. Oh, well, guess what? I'm going to shoot. Is that Wesker from no. Residency, nigga? You finna get busted on. Huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know what I'm doing now. I'm assuming we heading this way. Maybe we got to jump up. Uh-huh. I'm assuming. Boulder. Okay, we got... Damn. See, she was so finesseful back here. Grab that. So, gonna make like a... Okay, listen, I'm rating tombs. We ain't even in the tomb yet, are we? If my mind is telling me, yep. Come on now. Yes, sir. What we doing? What we doing? That's shiny. Press that. Grapple. Okay. Did she even have a grapple in the survival trilogy? I know she had that little thing that acts or little pick thing she could climb with. Sort of danced around, screaming, yelling, whatever. Bro, it's a Neo. <laughs> Twins, freak. Yeah, whatever, man. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Come on now. What the freak do y'all really want? Jump up in the sky. Yep. I jumped up, flipped, shot him in his neck. I love these type of games though. Like it's really just Tomb Raider and Uncharted. Y'all let me know if there's any other games where you know raiding tombs, climbing, you know, outside of Assassin's Creed. But like the main plot is to find treasure. It's not too many. I love the swinging animation, bro. He's agile as hell. Yeah! Ooh. No freaking way. Ooh. Did you see that slide? Am I tripping or did I slid to him? I, sl I slid it. Jump up and... Wait, what? Off screen grapple press and... Then A to connect. Ugh. Ugh. I guess maybe you can count Horizon. You wasn't really looking for treasures, but the climbing, grappling, especially part two. They just added the extra robots. Isn't she beautiful? Yes, you are. I mean, are you... Okay. Isn't uh, Agent Carter or gonna... She's gonna be voicing Tomb Raider in... Uh, the animated show that's coming out. I actually think, was it this game or it was another game that got, uh, oh, snap. Ugh, okay. Yeah, yeah, the anniversary of one of these games just happened. Oh, yeah, these are, see, man, if it wasn't for all the other games we were playing, I would definitely play these, bro, but I need to switch to, what's up? What's up? What's up? Ooh, oh, yeah. See, I would play these. I would play these in full, but I'm gonna have to go to the next game, bro. Tomb Raider anniversary. Yes, sir. I hope I'm going in the right order. I think this is the next one. Crystal Dynamic Buzz Monkey. Oh, snap. Ooh, we back in Los Alamos. That was from the, the first game or second game or the OG trilogy. Another explosion. And I feel like, yeah, the Survivor trilogy didn't, the trilogy didn't have too many, like, epicness. You know, we was dealing with some crazy stuff. Like, what was that game that started out with the flood, bro? I think that was Shadow, the last one. That one was crazy. I can't wait to replay the uh, Survivor trilogy. I wish I had time to play these, though, bro. That would just be adding fuel to the fire. We got so much to play. The freak? Is that a parademon? What kind of intro was that? What the freak? Okay. Let's 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 begin. Look at Laura, though. She just get beautifuler and uh, beautifuler. I'm definitely disappointed in the Survivor Trilogy now, bro, because we never saw those boobies. All right. We got to start off in Croft Manor. You know what it is. Croft Manor. It's zoomed out. It's, like, way more zoomed out than the other games maybe it's just for this section open up this door i don't know where it's taking me but i'm heading in is my buttons the same okay we crouch with that got you yep spinorama i've never been fond of locked doors bruh me neither where the key at what's this the native population of costa rica was ravaged by diseases brought by its conquerors and barely managed to survive to see the establishment of a capital city damn that's it they didn't tell me how to open doors laura india 1996 with it that's crazy. That's when uh my sister was born. <laughs> I wasn't even a thought yet, bro. It's crazy when you think about it like that, bro. Now what's oh, a man she made it big. Get that sort of attention from? Wait a minute. Is this a remake if of the first the sort one? Of attention you want, Larson. Cause yeah, this is. Well on your way. Sounds like hmm. fun, but I'm only here to make an introduction. Okay. Lara Croft, meet Jacqueline Napa of Napa. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Good afternoon, Miss Croft. Maybe she might be sick my though. Let me not. The department has recently turned its focus to the study of ancient artifacts. Her hands. And I'm led to believe that Oh, no, nah, that's right Cruella. You're just the woman to find them for me. I'm afraid no. you've been misled. I only play for sport. 
Which is precisely why I've come to you, Miss Croft. This no way. Played before with your father. That's a damn Tim you Burton character. Years searching for the Skion of Atlantis. Yeah, her father was. was the location of Qualapex's tomb. You found Vilcabamba. Vilca who? How quickly can you get to Peru? Two minutes, and now we're here. That was quicker than two minutes. I need a raise. But nah, is this this is like a, a remake of the first one? It seems like. Let's just proceed, okay? Yep, little shimmy. Um, detonate. Mm, so now it's jumping an X. No, nope. she did have a grapple on the on the uh, Survivor trilogy, if I'm not mistaken. I just don't remember right now. But okay, doing my thing. I got my dual pistols. Did she even have dual pistols? She had a bow and any other weapon she could find. Yeah, we got to get right with the, with this new game. I'm glad they said that they're unifying it or whatever. Who is this though? The freak you want about, bro? It's a swing of Mabu up there. How do I get to swing of Mabu? Hold on, head this way. Come on now, look at me. This big brain activities. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Check me out. Just like that. And now, I climb up. Ugh. See, that's one thing about these games, bro. I think I played so many. I can um, you know, point out my climbable objects. Let me stop, bro. I can't see. When I be playing them Lego games, I don't know what I'm looking at. The doors are opening. Yeah, this is this is like a remake of the first game. So d is this really a trilogy? Well, I guess it's 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 a remake, but it's still set in its own thing. Like I don't. Yep. Look at them freaking wolves. Oh my god. Yeah. yeah, she is too finessful, bro. Hey, listen. If we ever get the time in the future, maybe I'll come back and replay these. Cause she freaking. Oh my gosh. She like Black Widow. Survivor Laura won't do none of this. I mean, she had to survive, but you know. Oh man. But maybe I'm forgetting some stuff though. That's why I can't wait to replay them. Hold on though. Hold on. Bro, that new one is gonna be with Unreal Engine 5. What? That's gonna be crazy. Okay, so if this is a remake of the first one though, them spike things gonna shoot out the wall. If that happens, then yep, yeah, okay. So I'm already knowing some wolves is gonna pop out. Um, and uh, well, I ain't really do much in that first game. It was wolves and a tiger. No, tiger was part two, right? Big traversal. Mm. Maybe, hold up, hold on. I can shimmy around this way. Maybe you gotta go up and do something. Maybe I was going the wrong way this entire time. Head up here. Hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. Here we go. Here we go. Get them gats out. Oh yeah, the 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 bats. This is literally the the first one. Okay, go up. Oh, stationary. Hold Y and go up. Got you. I gotta get on level with that right there. Then I'm a swine. Then I'm a swine. Ugh, Cause low key, they could remake this, but it'll be like a retelling. You know what I'm saying? Where am I jumping? To? Oh, jump up. Okay. Then jump back. Jump back. Ugh. Just like that. Oh yeah. Drop off a ledge. Got you. Oh, look at me. Can I make that jump though? Hold up. Oh gosh. <laughs> Tomb Raider Underworld. I won't about to just accept defeat like that, bro. We on to the next game. This is the one I remember the most. This actually might've been the first Tomb Raider that I played. I remember being in the water. I remember the, the manor actually blowing up. Cause yeah, this doesn't even have Wayne Manor. I mean, bro, Croft Manor. Yeah, we can't even go there in this one. Who do I need to sue? You don't start a game like that. As soon as I hit start, the house blow up. Maybe this is Wayne Manor, bro. Nightfall Protocol. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. She's so beautiful even when she's scared. That's weird. That's kind of creepy. I'll take it back. Hold up. How we just starting like this? Oops, I'm sorry. I stepped in the fire. This is low key. It's crazy because it's obviously it's made by Crystal Dynamics, the Survivor Trilogy. But you can see the... um. How this one is so much more like the Survivor Trilogy, especially 2014 or 13. Okay. Like the way she was running and everything. Okay. Um, crouch. I'm not even looking at stuff. Yo, you hear this music? This is God of War? Um, okay. Oh, this. I'm tripping. Oh my gosh. There's too much going on. Um, what the? Oh, jump on the wall. Yo, I'm terrified. Imagine being in something like this, bro. Climbing would be like the best skill you could have. I thought she was gonna like, okay, push that, yep. Just like on uh, Legend, got you. Right there, I see it, I see it. Let me see if I can just jump over. <laughs> yep, you see, so people was always out to get her dad, right? I forgot, cause I know it's, like I said earlier, sometimes she don't like her dad, sometimes she do, right? Oh my 
This is off to a horrible start, but we doing something. Okay. Now, uh, okay, safety drop. Safety drop. Come on. Yeah. Why are you screaming for? Oh, there go Alfred. It's not. I know. What the freak? Was that me? Who was shooting? Yo. Oh, man, I wish we had time. I want to play these. I want to play these. And if I watch that lore video, I'm going to get spoiled. I don't really mind for games like this one week earlier. See, this is the water. Uh oh, what you got on? I mean, uh, she get framed for something, though? Hold up. Hold ah! up. Oh, my gosh, bro. I feel like that DJ Academics freaking <laughs> meme, bro. Hey, Laura. Find it yet? And dare the black Patient dude go. Zip. I warned Zip. you that conveniently undiscovered islands would be scarce in the Mediterranean. Oh, Are no. Sure this Eddington chap knows what he's talking about? Probably not. Y'all know I got to skip cutscene. She says something about her dad need to uh, go look for something. Ooh, we can sprint now in this game. Holding LB. Okay, jump in the water. Let's dive. Oh, snap. Holy moly. See, man. Unreal Engine 5, bro. Can y'all imagine an Unreal Engine 5 Tomb Raider game? Shoot enemies. Okay, got you. There's no in it. It's a damn shark. Later. Oh my God. Let's go all the way down to the ground floor. Let's just see if there's anything. Anything to pick up. I don't see nothing highlighting. I mean, I'm, hold up. Hold up. Here we go. Do I still got my... Okay, I do. I got a flashlight and all that. For help, go to field assistance in the PDA. Where is that at? Field assistance. Something seems to be missing from the center of each of those discs. Okay. What I, I do? I try putting the axle from the pedestal into one of the discs. The axle from the pedestal. Here we go. Okay. So we need axle for pedestal. Okay, I see what she's saying. Each of these need one. That got one in the center. So I need to find one for right here. Many, many minutes later. All right, finally. Found this other little thing. I'm about to go put it in the other little thing and turn the little thing so we can get through the other thing. I need to turn the three discs on the wall until the eyes on the middle disc are all open. Oh, I got you. I got you right now. Check me out. Every, every one of them got to have an eye on them, right? So boom, just like that. Now I take you and I move you. Come on now. I does this. Check me out, y'all. Oh yeah, open sesame. All right, I'm assuming I'm going the right way. Turn that flashlight back on. Okay, bunch of jellyfish is in the way, but don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Ting. It might be time to worry. That's the part that like all of this unintrigues me. Of unintrigue is a word. But like, I ain't dealing with sea creatures. Like I'm never, you never gonna see Kage SMG near water. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how to swim and I'm proud of it. You feel me? And none of my family gonna be near water. So it's like, I don't gotta worry about saving nobody from drowning. Innocent bystander, that's an unfortunate case. What's this right here? Why? Okay. Maybe this gonna activate lights for me? Get the gats out. What did that do? I see X up there. For what reason? Pool? Why did I do that, bro? I broke cuz. Ooh, something. Okay. I'll pull it. Okay, so we need to do this over here as well. Ah. Uh, okay. Okay. We're gonna. Did that land on it? It did. So can't I just stand here? What are these boxes? Oh, I might need both of them. Here we go. Here we go. Hold up. Let's put this one on. This is like a set of lungs. Place that right there. And then. I don't know what I'm doing. Maybe press this thing again. Because when we press it the first time, nothing happened. Maybe we're supposed to. Perfect. Tomb Raider brain. I'm getting myself ready, bro. I'm trying to tell you. No devs, no getting stuck on the Survivor Trilogy, dude. Incredible. Yeah, show Cold Liz. Look at them. Th really I mean. Similar to early there you go. Yeah. But this is far yeah. older than the 5th century. Yet, strangely enough, more sophisticated. Who y'all think? I didn't really, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to make it a competition or comparison. I'm about to say rooms. who y'all think is smarter, Laura Let's or Nathan see. Drake. They World both fire. Mist. That would be Niflheim, the realm of the dead. Niflheim. Not exactly, but the Norse equivalent. Oh gosh, what's on your back? It's a harpoon or something? Okay, Niflheim. Hey yo, get some sprint action. I don't like this place, man. It's just it ain't it ain't safe. It's unnatural. Niflheim. She talking about the land of the dead. Nigga, I'm alive. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Is that an octopus? Or a squid? Whatever. 
No way. Stop. I'll uninstall. <laughs> it better not go into gameplay. Leave just the cutscene. It's blind? Ugh, that stance is kind of field camera. Is this... What do you mean? What, what, do, you, what, what do, do you mean? mean? Why is this gameplay? What do I need to do to him? Am I just jumping down? Oh my gosh. I'm finna... <laughs> all right y'all that's gonna wrap up the gameplay portion of this video which is it's gonna be a pretty long video man i'm gonna cut a lot out so maybe it won't be as long but look at this it's just a big tomb raider appreciation video before we get into the survivor trilogy i wanted to go back and you know pay my respects to the ogs first with that being said i found this video right here of the complete lore of the og trilogy as well as the legend trilogy i'm gonna be going through maybe most of the videos because they're pretty long but luckily this is broken up into different chapters so i can go to the certain game that i want to know about because all of the like extra og games that you know the first trilogy or franchise started with i never even played those so maybe i don't need to know much but as always let me know any tips tidbits fun facts down in the comments uh that i might need to know about laura croft cora's banquet the same brewing tradition since 1873 when you're the favorite beer of rockstar this year the tomb raider franchise turns tw This year, the Tomb Raider franchise turns 25. That being, with that being, with that being said, let's get into this it. This year, the Tomb Raider franchise okay. turns 25 years old. We hear it suggests 25. This was three years ago. Damn. This occasion would be to look back at the story of all of the games featuring our favorite yeah. adventurer Lara Croft so yep. far. Because this is obviously such a massive undertaking, this journey required me to recruit some help. So I please bet. welcome streamer and YouTuber oh my gosh. Steve of War. Thank you, so have thank you. Please. Pyramids blowing oh, up. You're too kind. Please hold your applause. Shout out Steve of War. I have my wife and kids. Please send help. Seeing as the Tomb Raider franchise. What? So I see here Tomb Raider 3 prehistory. So Tomb Raider 3 is really like the beginning. Maybe they're going in chronological order. Let me see. Our story begins millions okay. of years before the common era when a meteor crashes into Earth. Causing okay, a so large three explosion is... decimating the entire area. All right. Throughout the following years, the Polynesians discover the meteor and find it to contain unnatural powers. They sculpt it into four separate artifacts before burying it inside a chamber beneath Antarctica. I see. Years later, in ancient China, Emperor hey, Shi Huang obtains the Dagger of Xi'an, which yeah, he's the able Fire to use by plunging it into his heart. The dagger's mystical powers transform him into a gargantuan, <laughs> fire-breathing dragon, and he proceeds Damn. to lead his army to conquer the land. I didn't even realize However, that, was, dragon -led army that was happening. The Great Wall, a Tibetan monk is able to bring a stop to the destruction by pulling the dagger out of his body. Later, Shout out the to the most hated. The Damn, why you hate it? Away in the Temple of Xi'an, and when one places it in its resting place, a blast of energy kills him as the door locks behind. Oh, wow. Over 2,000 years later, in 1834, four sailors set off to travel around the world in Charles Darwin's ship, the HMS Is Beagle. Is this... In Antarctica, like, do I need to know this? Meteoric Hold on, this However, might be... they are soon attacked by a pack of wolves and are forced to leave the caverns. One Damn member wolves, of the crew, bro. Paul Caulfield, dies during the escape, and the remaining crew decide to bury him, leaving a crude wooden headstone in his memory before sailing off to return home. That's probably Afterwards, what we're looking the for. Some um... separate to different locations across the Damn. world, each taking an artifact with them. However, when three of them are subsequently murdered, one in Nevada, one in the South Pacific, and one in India, the See, her dad member, probably Stephen started Barr, looking. Sells his artifact in London out of superstition. And I went to go finish it, maybe. On July 16th, 1945, in Los oh. Alamos, New Mexico. Oh. A nuclear, whoops! I mean, nuclear test blasts open <laughs> a buried device revealing a woman. Must be like a running joke in a frozen pod. I remember seeing that. I thought in it was an alien. We meet Here we go. Old Lara Croft, staying with her family. I didn't even see this in his cottage in Ireland. Winston is ready for bed. Her family's priest, Father about Patrick to say, Dunstan, sixteen the house to speak with Winston. Lara eavesdrops on their conversation, learning okay. that the nearby villagers have been reporting sightings of apparitions on the Black Island. Oh, snap, Father that's where Patrick my family stay. to head there to exercise these spirits, and Lara sneaks onto his boat to I thought that was a damn herself. Smeagol, nigga, Gollum. Once on the island, Lara comes across a ghastly undead oh, yeah, this is hanging three. from the gallows tree. He tasks Lara with returning his heart to its resting place, Bro. stolen from him and placed somewhere within the world tree, promising an otherworldly reward. So she Lara really been doing this since and since Father a jit. Patrick, surprised to see her there. He tells her to wait for him at the nearby chapel and she heads out. She finds and releases the heart, allowing her to move forward into the chapel. There she sees a vision of death and falls into a labyrinth at beneath 16? the chapel. 
Inside the lab, Lara finds a mysterious book before reuniting with Father. I mean, it's not Dad Young, but His bro, hair what? Now a ghostly white. The pair leave the labyrinth, and Father Patrick explains that the book she found is the Bestiary, which okay. contains incantations on how to protect herself from the various demons on the island. Shortly so after, let me Father see. She 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 figured out how to get out of there is what I'm seeing, right? Because I want to skim through some of this. I ain't want to watch the whole thing. Like Tomb Raider Chronicles, I probably won't watch. Maybe I'll finish this on my lonely. It's about to get into Chronicles now. Or this is Chronicles. So I guess they, the prehistory was in three. Chronicles is what we were covering. So let me go to, let's fast forward Tomb Raider Chronicles. Yeah, these are a bunch of like prequels. I'll look at some of this stuff on my lonely. Tomb Raider 1996. Let's see here. All right, Philosopher's Stone is what she was looking the for. She year, found Lara it. Lara Croft is met in a hotel in Calcutta, and then India this. by Larson, who connects okay, her via Larson. video call with his employer, Jacqueline Natla. Natla, the owner of Natla Technologies, offers Lara a job retrieving a mystic artifact from yeah. the unfound tomb of Qualipec in Peru. Lara, enticed by the hunt, agrees and makes her way to the Peruvian mountains. That's that dude. There, <laughs> Freaking anniversary. Carlos I skipped a cutscene. Carlos, okay. When Lara opens it, a pack of this wolves is crazy. emerge and maul Carlos, instantly yeah. killing him. So anniversary was definitely and heads into remade. Caves beyond alone. Lara traverses the caves and eventually oh, man. finds the entrance to Qualipec's tomb. Okay. But finds that she must stop a waterfall blocking its entrance. That is not a she waterfall, but I got you. Lost world, yeah, dinosaurs? An ancient area where dinosaurs have survived extinction. Bro. A mistake that she soon begins to correct. Okay. There, I'm going to have to go back and play these. Various velociraptors and a Tyrannosaurus Rex the remaster to find gonna be... the mechanism to block the waterfall, allowing her to enter Qualipec's tomb. All right. Inside, Lara finds a skeleton on a throne beside the artifact she was sent to retrieve. Bro, on it's going to wake it, up. However, the tomb begins to collapse around her, and she is forced to make a hasty escape. She's got a shotgun. Outside, a... however, Lara is ambushed by Larson, Larson. who reveals that the ambushed. artifact she recovered is merely a piece of something called the Skion, and that Natla had sent Pierre Dupont to find the rest. Lara then knocks out Larson with a swift kick before heading out <laughs> to find and question Bro. Natla. Lara so she began to betrayed Washington a lot and breaks into Natla Technologies headquarters to find Jacqueline's office. Okay. There, she doesn't find the woman, but instead so finds Jacqueline a big bad belonging to a monk named Brother Herbert, which Brother she needs to learn that the Skion holds the incredible powers held by the lost civilization of Atlantis. Pause it. Skion I'm finna skip through. Let's just see how this mug resolves. Lara is able to sneak onto the yacht by loudly driving off a ramp and diving off the bike and into the see water. See her neck. Then makes her way under the Oh my gosh, she's a, bro. Why why where are they so out from you know? Holy when moly. Lara awakens, she finds That's herself ridiculous. at the boat's destination, a desert bro. island containing <laughs> an underground system of mines used by Natla. Lara finds her weapons and kills all three of Natla's henchmen before finding the Great Pyramid of Atlantis. So Natla was Just the big, Lara big enters, bad. Natla reaches a pedestal inside where she places the ski on, restoring the pyramid's energy source. Mm, we saw this Lara pyramid blow up in the beginning, right? Mutated creatures, oh my gosh, he's Resonance Evil. Before reaching the top of the Yo. pyramid, where she finds the pedestal, this with new the one got a chance to be when amazing. When Lara grabs it, she encounters another vision of the past, where she learns that Natla herself was the third ruler of Atlantis. Whoa! After betraying the other rulers, reincarnation or something? Great pyramid to create an army of her own twisted design. Qualipec and Tihokin punished her by stripping her of her piece of the skion before placing her in a frozen tomb, where she stayed until the nuclear test freed her. No way. Then Not even reincarnation. Lara, that's that's her. Her plan to create a mutant army to strengthen and enhance humanity. Bro, Lara what? Attempts to stop this plot by shooting the Skion, but Natla tackles her off the platform where they stand. Damn, death. Lara is able to grab onto a nearby ledge, but Natla falls to the depths below. Okay. When Lara climbs to safety, what the she discovers Natla's creation. These bosses. A large mutated creature with no legs that she is fortunately able to defeat. Lara okay. then climbs back up to the pedestal and shoots at the Skion, destroying it and triggering an explosion that the pyramid, to bring yeah. down the pyramid. Okay. As Lara makes her way through the Imagine dropping this as your first game back Natla then, bro. Once more, now showing her true Atlantean form. No After way. She just got battle, wings, niggas. You weren't the same thing. for good before narrowly escaping the now destroyed pyramid and leaving on Natla's yacht. Okay. Oh my gosh, bro. Joker 2 boy. That last shot, I mean, I'm going to skip it, but bro, yeah. Can't wait to see that one. 
But Tomb Raider 1 was very year, interesting. Lara arrives at the Great Wall of China okay, to search two? the Dagger of Shan. There Gotta she be. finds a series of catacombs and fights a pair of Tyrannosaurus Rexes on her way to the entrance <laughs> of the Dagger's resting place. As Let me she see. investigates the door's yeah, locking two. mechanism, she's ambushed by a man named Claudio, who she Claudio. defeats. Because he he's a buster. He is a follower of a man called Macho Broccoli. <laughs> No Sorry, freaking way. Of habit, Marco Bartoli, I'm about to say. tasked him to protect the door from being opened until the right time. He then pulls out a flask and upon drinking its contents, immediately dies. Damn. He uses his <laughs> laptop to learn that Bartoli resides in Via Carvelli, Venice, and immediately okay. heads out to find him and the rest of his cult followers. So we in Venice she for this one? an under construction opera house Bro. Is being used by the cult called the Fiamma Is he just walking around like that? Like he's able to sneak onto a seaplane of theirs where she eavesdrops on a conversation between Marco and his pilot. She learns that his father, Gianni Bartoli, had possessed something called the Seraph, which the Fiamma is currently searching for. But before she can learn more, she's discovered and knocked out no way. the plane's mechanic. Damn. While she's unconscious, the plane docks at an offshore oil rig in the Adriatic Sea. When Lara awakens, I swear, she, she, she never catch a break, but I can tell you that much. But conveniently, they decided to lock her in a room with a lever that's able to open the cell door. So Bruh. it's not long until she escapes, finds her pistols, and is able to make her way through the facility. Eventually, she finds Bartoli's men torturing a Tibetan monk in an attempt to learn the location of the Seraph. Lara takes them out to save the man and learns that the cult has been excavating the underwater shipwreck of Bartoli's father's vessel, the Maria Daria, a ship that was sunk years ago by the monks to prevent him from using the Seraph to gain access to a powerful relic they hold in their monastery. After Lara changes into <laughs> a nearby like wetsuit, Marco arrives and shoots the monk dead, forcing Lara to run off Jeez. to avoid the same fate. She what kind of run was that? She into the water and then dives in after it to follow the cult to the shipwreck at the bottom of the sea. Then after right. a passing shark sinks the submarine, Lara makes her way into the shipwreck, and after navigating through its dilapidated this interior, one, she obtains the If I was born this, during this time, I would probably be she commandeers the cult first one, it seems like the superior so far. Let me see how this one ends. This one seems a little shorter. Who? The, the macho dude? But however, Bartoli, who had found yep. her inside, beats her to it, and she witnesses the man impale himself in the heart with the dagger before being carried off by his men. Following Bartoli through the mythical floating islands of Shan, she eventually reaches the dragon's chamber just before he transforms into the mythical beast. Jeez. Lara battles Dude, the dragon and is eventually what the able to remove the dagger powering him. I did not know she'd be battling much dragons. Like Emperor Qin Huang did centuries earlier. Bro. However, this triggers a chain reaction and the tomb begins to crumble around her. I need to go she watch her movies too. I might, to I might do those. She narrowly escapes before an explosion seals up the temple for good. Just like the first game. With Lara now back at home and with a fancy this new three? Oh in the kitchen, she Bro. begins to settle in for the evening. But just as she begins to relax, Bartoli's men arrive to avenge the death of their leader, forcing I thought Lara it was to over. grab a nearby shotgun to defend her home. No After wonder that was an outfit. Inside her mansion, Lara is able to yeah, they had to damn defend herself the in the bathroom. Goaded. Finally, getting a chance to relax with a nice hot shower. But Bruh. Not before eliminating <laughs> He's kill a, a bunch of people. Spectator. Ow! Okay, oh wow! Fine. I get it. I'll That's be. a cool detail. They know what they're doing, bro. They know exactly, bro. Lara works with a I'm trying to see something. I'm sorry. To infiltrate Zip. Von Croy oh, wow. Industries headquarters. Is this three? Von this is Chronicles Croy again. The okay, I'm gonna skip through this, but we know actually this is three. Chronicles is just something happened in the middle. Let's go to three then. But I know Zip is a character. Was he in the Survivor? I know he was. She was with that one dude. Founder bro. of the RX Tech Mining Company. Leading an excavation team in Antarctica, searching in three. for the meteorite cavern discovered by the sailors on the HMS Beagle years ago. He is taken to a site nearby with a Polynesian Bro. statue, much like those on Easter Island. And when he walks over to investigate the area, he discovers Paul Caulfield's headstone, indicating that he has found the HMS Beagle's landing site. Later that year, Lara learns of an artifact held by the Infata tribes in this, Kolkata, this? India. Because they said the. Uh, Prehistory for three is when the, the dragons or whatever happened, then those adventurers was going and got ate by the wolves and died. For it. However, so uh, she, she got to find the artifacts. She finds an RX Tech camp inhabited by a researcher named Tony, who informs Tony. her that his partners, Randy and Rory, entered a nearby temple, one he plans to get away from as soon as possible. Lara heads inside the temple and finds Randy and Rory. However, Damn, both what? are dead and suspended in the air. After I ain't realize how gruesome these modes were too, Shiva, and crazy. The exit of the temple, Definitely got to go play once these. Again finds Tony sailing on a raft with a mysterious stone in his chest. She fires at him before Bruh, he turns to he's her. Iron Man. And uses some kind of supernatural <laughs> power to trigger the platform Lara is on to collapse. She then finds a nearby quad bike and uses it to follow Tony down the river. No way. Eventually finding his raft crashed at the base of a waterfall. 
Inside the caves beyond the waterfall, Lara finds a now super-powered Tony, who she is forced to fight. So After that stone. Him, she retrieves the Infata stone and exits okay. the cavern, conveniently finding Dr. Willard on a boat outside. The two then converse about the stone. He informs her of the meteorite the stone came from, the existence of three more, the fate of the sailors that found them, as well as their now rumored locations. All right. He then asks Lara to help him retrieve the others, and always up for a challenge, she agrees and the pair head off. Got you. Pause it right there. Let's, let's look at the outcome. We looking for stones, okay? Helicopter, helicopter, what's happening? Traveling in gets caught in a blizzard and crash lands, and she's barely able to escape before it sinks into the icy waters. I swear. On her way to find she got Willard, bad look, look. <laughs> she got bad look, She got bad look and scientist. equally good look. And when she finds Willard in his cabin, she confronts him about the mutation, only what to they find not out that like the that? scientist was mutated by the effects of the meteorite. Willard then reveals that with the artifacts in his possession, he can use their combined power to speed up the process of human evolution on a global scale. You might be Lara, a villain. not agreeing with this plan, uh, yeah. refuses to hand over the artifacts, but he knocks her over and steals them. No way. Off afterwards. Betrayal Lara again. follows Willard below the surface into the RX tech mines beneath, eventually finding them to lead to the lost city of Tinnus, where the ancient Polynesian civilization that discovered the meteorite once so, lived. I need to know when After I go into the Survivor Trilogy, mutated by the what the hell? Of the meteorite, I gotta Lara be prepared for Willard betrayal. The chamber. Willard and jumps into a cavern, and with the now concentrated of power of the meteorite, he is mutated into a large, spider-like creature and attacks Lara. She's I did not know they had the enemies like that, bro. We didn't see that in, in the Survivor Trilogy. The power of not the that I remember. And allowing her to finally kill the mutated Doctor. Definitely the one to get more, go not goofy, but more the surface where she finds like this. The helicopter landing. In the new she one. She approaches it, kills the pilot, and takes off. <laughs> in the bro. air, she is shot at she by really turrets, a serial killer. missiles, and eventually another helicopter. But she's able to outsmart and outmaneuver her opposition, allowing her to leave Antarctica with four new trophies for her. She the goats. She's the freaking go, bro. Year, to Which Russia game is this? Chronicles again? Charles Kane I think that's it. That was three, right? Tomb Raider, the last something. Revenge, maybe. Then we got. I heard about Angel of Darkness. People were saying that that one was fire. They wanted a remake of it. Because, like, none of this is probably going to even matter. Because, you know, it's a reboot. The survivor. Her outfits are like, you know what I'm saying? Fire. Especially for the female fashion, you know? Like, she had swag, bro. Damn. No freaking way, you freaking mutt. Oh, they shot because. Damn, this one is long. Angel of Darkness must have been freaking hit, bro. People talked about it. It's a long guy game. Something. I don't even know. I'm skimming through it. Okay, y'all. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm about to finish this, man. Once again, y'all let me know stuff in the comments. Let's move on into the Legend trilogy. Wait a minute. 86. Huh? And she frantically pulls the sword from the okay. pedestal, causing an explosion. When Lara opens her eyes, she finds the mechanism disabled, but also This must have happened the when they landed as well as her mother in the in the plane crash. She then tears Whoa. out a few pages of her journal and leaves them there. As she leaves the temple to find a way to contact her father, archaeologist Lord Richard Croft. Okay. Lara's father takes her under his wing, taking okay. her on his expeditions, training her as an archaeologist. So However, she learned everything like from wife, him. He wound up going missing in Cambodia when Lara was 17. Damn. Lara continues was he her found? in archaeology, meeting another young woman named Amanda Evert, who she quickly becomes best friends with. Amanda. The two go with their classmates on an expedition in Peru, and while exploring an underground cavern, their group is attacked by a demonic-looking creature surrounded by black smoke. What the freak? Lara runs from the creature to find Amanda <laughs> investigating a stone relic she hopes will open the Amanda, what you door. got on? Despite Lara's hesitation, Amanda pulls the stone from its pedestal, oh, causing he's gonna the die. creature to disappear. However, Never mind. they soon hear a Say loud today. rumble as the cave starts to collapse. Lara escapes through a gate that closes behind her. She oh, tries damn. to keep it open long enough for Amanda to escape, but the area begins to flood with water. Amanda's damn. foot gets stuck, and she's unable to escape through the gate. Lara watches more rocks fall from above, separating her from her friend, as she is Laura, forced to go. drop she the over. gate yeah. and leave Amanda behind, escaping as damn. the only survivor of the tragedy. Why is she going to come back at the end of the game, probably? Freaking advertisement. Sometime shortly afterwards, Lara travels to Calcutta, Anniversary. India, where she is approached by a mercenary named Larson Conway, who introduces yep. her via video call to Jack Natler, CEO of one of the world's largest. So tech now we know Natla was Google. really. I mean, Natla Technologies. Bruh. 
she was really one of the, the founders of Atlantis, something like that. So we, yeah, we can we can skip through this one. Let's see what Underworld was about. Well, here's Legend again. I guess they're going in chronological order. Cause this says legend. A research assistant. Hold on. She oh yeah. Receives a tip from one of her former Guess they were going in order. That would make sense because she was young in that first part. That was like a flashback. Then I guess anniversary happened. So legend. About a stone okay. Dais that's similar to the one that she saw in the Himalayas as a child. Okay. Still hoping to uncover the mystery of her mother's disappearance, Lara travels to the temple of an ancient civilization called Tiwanaku in Bolivia. Got you. After exploring it, she finds the stone dais, but unfortunately, a team of mercenaries has beaten her to its discovery. Their leader, That's like that one dude on Uncharted. James I hated Rutland, that, bro. Notices Lara and reveals that Uncharted he has a piece of a sword, much like the one that had disappeared with her mother. As he turns to leave, he gestures to a blonde woman in a nearby helicopter, who he refers to as Amanda, before referencing no the expedition to Peru, where her old friend Amanda Everett seemingly died. I knew it, bro. Wonder if she'd actually somehow survived. Of course, she's gonna end up on the dark leaves, side. Lara fights off the mercenaries that he left behind, and then after dispatching them all, she is able to investigate the dais, discovering it to be identical to the one where her mother disappeared. Mm. She then what about her dad? Home, then discusses her findings with bro, look Zip, at them Alistair, I'm sorry. and her lifelong butler. I'm Zip, bro. I'm claiming it. Zip recommends yeah. that Lara That's tries me, returning bro. to the archaeological dig site in Peru to learn Laura, what my wife. Whitman discovered there. Lara returns to Peru, Hold where on. she meets with her contact Anaya, and then after fighting off an ambush by Rutland's militia, the pair reach the old boarded up dig site, and Lara okay. is able to swim back into the flooded chamber where she left Amanda. There, Lara she is able find to her, drain or... the water and discovers an unlaced shoe, revealing that Amanda no way. was able to get her foot unstuck and escape the tomb. Yeah, she probably gonna hate Lara, Lara or something, because Lara got famous by this point, right? Let me see, let's skim through a little. Who is that right there? That might be Laura alone. Arranged at a corporate party hosted by a mutual friend named Toru Nishimura. The next day, Lara arrives in Tokyo, then heads Say. to the party to meet with Nishimura in his office. The two share Damn, Nishi. trees, and when Lara goes to enter the main area, Takamoto arrives with his Yakuza crew, breaking up the party. He refuses to negotiate with Lara, still holding a grudge over their last encounter where he tried to forge artifacts. Angered by their confrontation, he commands oh his men to attack Lara as he escapes, but she grabs the weapons she smuggled in and fights them off. Lara Ugh. regroups with Nishimura, Lara. who warns against following She's Takamoto, be the lock screen, but bro. nonetheless gives and her a key to the elevator to reach the and roof and so she reach his penthouse. Lara goes to the roof, and once there she finds a motorcycle stashed in a shipping bro. crate, which she is able She's to use to jump OP, the gap to bro. the next door building and work her way up to Takamoto's penthouse. So we gotta there get rid of him, the damn Yakuza. Long goddamn game. I want to hear about Amanda. Oh, who is that? Takes pictures of the map and sends it back to Alistair, hoping its resemblance to King Arthur's shield isn't just a coincidence. When Lara catches up, she finds Amanda, who reveals that uh. she still carries the stone she grabbed in the catacombs during their expedition. She then shows Lara mm, that the stone allows her, her to life. control the smoke-covered beast that killed her no friends. No way. Lara is able to fend off the beast using machinery in the lab and obtains the sword fragment. I can't wait to play through this, bro. This then blows I don't care about spoilers, so I'm Lara just. Lara watches Amanda walk off before escaping through the ventilation system. Alistair determines that the map takes them to Cornwall, England, to a roadside novelty attraction called Professor Worth's King Arthur Museum, and the trio okay. travel there to investigate. In yeah, I'll get all the extra tidbits when I actually play it. I want to see what happened. You know the resolution As Lara real quick. To use the sword of her, grabs her stone and calls forth her monster. No Lara way. Is able to defeat the monster with the sword, and an exhausted Amanda is left collapsed on the ground. Damn, Amanda. Lara takes the wraith stone amulet from her and then proceeds to plunge the sword into the dais. Runes begin to light up on is the stone. Is Amanda dead? I'm Lara not turning my back. them for the temple in the Himalayas as a child. As mm. she pushes the sword deeper, a portal begins to open, and she sees her mother. No Lara way. realizes it was her that her mother was speaking to in the portal all those years ago, and tries to tell her not to touch the sword. Amanda, however, yells out for Lara to pull out the sword or else the portal will explode. Amelia hears Amanda and believing that the warning was to be for her, pulls out the sword, leading to her disappearance Damn. in the past, as well as all of the events that have transpired. The portal explodes, and Lara, blaming Amanda for her mother's death now, pulls a pistol out on her and angrily asks, Where is How did my you... mother? <laughs> Amanda proclaims How did that you Amelia miss that many is times? not dead, but instead went to Avalon, the mythical island of Arthurian legend that the portal supposedly opened up Is to. that where her dad is? Lara, still in disbelief, decides to pistol whip Amanda, knocking her unconscious <laughs> instead of killing her. 
Then she leaves Bolivia now with the knowledge that her father, who has previously believed that Amelia had never died, was actually correct. Hmm. Determined to make things right, she starts a new journey to find Avalon and finally rescue her mother. So her dad must have. Damn, it was about to say something. Sometime later, Lara learns oh, okay. that her father this is the path to Avalon lay at the bottom of a location in the Mediterranean okay. Sea. She travels there by so yacht. So we're this game was about us trying to find her mom. So why was Trip trying to, to shoot us in the beginning? Labeled as Niflheim, get betrayed. The realm of the dead, which Lara determines to be the Norse equivalent to Avalon. Okay. Inside, she finds a large statue of Thor, the Norse god of thunder, as well no as way. one of his gauntlets used to wield his mighty hammer. Mjolnir. No way. Lara retrieves the gauntlet, but before she can surmise what it has to do with Avalon, she is, is ambushed she worthy? by a group of mercenaries who knock her out and take the gauntlet. Oh yeah, when we definitely awakens, need more mystical stuff like this in the new one, bro. Amanda Evert sends her I'm trying to hold the for triggering Amanda? An explosive device, causing no a cave-in and sealing the exit. Lara oh, man, this... climbs out of the ruins and swims back to her boat. There, she is able to spot Amanda's ship in the nearby waters. No way, the Lara Survivor trilogy kind of is not wag, but Amanda's mercenaries to the lower these decks. stories kind of grip There, bro. she is able to find Amanda, who is speaking with an oh unknown my gosh. woman about the gauntlet now being bound to Lara, rendering it useless to Amanda. Amanda is forced to run off when she learns her ship is taking in water due to Lara's firepower, and when Lara walks in to investigate the second woman, she is shocked to learn that it is none other than Jacqueline yep. Natla, who is dug up and captured no by Amanda way. and her crew sometime before the events in Bolivia. How did she not Natla die when she failed to the thing? The they found was only part of a transportation network of portals, and Lara's mother look better, was though. taken to <clears throat> Avalon. She then okay. states that Lara's father found the wrong Norse underworld, as Amelia was not taken to Niflheim, so but what instead about... Helheim. Lara asks where it is, and Natla Stam responds God of that War. she'll need Thor's hammer to get there, and that no she needs way. to find her answers in Thailand. Oh, Natla's snap. pod is then extracted yeah, by a helicopter, I'm and sorry. Lara escapes from the now sinking ship. Bro. Outside, she sees Amanda and fires a few shots at her, prompting her to throw the gauntlet into the water. Lara jumps after it, retrieving it before returning to her boat to watch Amanda's helicopter fly off. Jeez. Lara travels to the coast of Thailand and finds another okay, underworld Okay, so now I guess we're looking for the hammer. Let's see if she finds it. Hold on, yeah, let me see what happened with Trip, though. Feels the, the rumble of a large explosion, and yep. fire begins to fill the hallway she's in. She works her way through the burning mansion to reach the main hall, finding Winston and Zip, just before the latter Zip. suddenly pulls a gun on Lara and fires at her. After he runs out of bullets, Zip reveals that he saw Lara open the retina scanning locks to her vault before setting fire to her own house, shooting mm -hmm. at him, then escaping with Amanda's wraith stone. Lara mm -hmm. tells Winston and Zip to leave while they can, then heads to the security area to watch the surveillance camera footage. Somebody when she gets into the imposter? security room, however, she turns to see her own reflection. This is like what the, the OG one. As they she say, gets closer, she realizes it is a near-identical doppelganger of herself. Yeah, that's not what doing, isn't it? shoot a nearby Alistair. Oh my gosh. Lara attempts to attack her doppelganger, but Yo. it quickly bests her in any attempt before escaping the man. Yo, the Survivor trilogy was kind of, they made him, it too like realistic. Her efforts, he proclaims that he'll see her in Avalon. Oh, I hope that this new Tomb Raider is like injuries. a trilogy too. And Outside, they uh, this unifying and watch the this and OG with the real Lara walk out carrying the lifeless body of Alistair. Damn, Zip RP Alistair. What it was, and Lara only responds that she had seen something similar of Natla's creation years ago. Yeah. But this one is far more dangerous. Oh, this man. This them to conclude that Natla and Amanda must be working together in some capacity. Amanda's a buster. Let me see how this mug concludes. Revels in Lara's pain. She then reveals that after learning of Amelia's disappearance years prior, she had manipulated her husband, Richard Croft, no into working way. for Natla before killing him for his betrayal. No way. She then way. used his daughter to finish his work and lead her to Helheim. So Natla is like Lara the goes Thanos of the, the Tomb Raider Natla, lore. But the doppelganger oh, she did arrives, get the hammer. Knocking it out of her no hands way. and subduing her. Oh, this store did Natla psh, then walks off to raise underworld. the Midgard Serpent while Lara fights with the doppelganger. No Much to way. Lara's surprise, Amanda arrives and uses the Wraith Stone to stop the doppelganger. Okay, Amanda. Her over the ledge into the okay, Amanda. Below. Amanda states that while she still harbors disdain for Lara, she has to help her to stop Natla to prevent the end of the world. Lara then runs off to stop Natla while Amanda stays behind to hold Bro, the thralls what the freak? at bay. 
Lara finds she get the stone back? Reveals that the she had the power again. Was actually but a it's just said. For the system of tectonic ridges on the ocean floor. And the relic Bro. she is currently activating will we cause really the, get the hold to split near. and spew the serpent's poison no into way. the air. Triggering Ragnarok and Natlas sought after seven. I never would have thought I would hear these Lara words in a tomb. To well, to she literally be the machine, looking for stuff like this, but bro. Fight brings her into the chamber. Natla notices this Amanda is crazy. and takes her out with a bolt of power, knocking her onto the floor. Lara Damn. continues to eliminate the machine's support oh, structures. Oh yeah, I'm running through these Natla games. I wish I had time to play them, you know, for the channel, but... While she's distracted, however, Lara throws Mjolnir at her, breaking the platform Bro. she stands on, sending her into the Eiter pit below oh, as I got the way more respect for Laura Croft. follows her in. I always knew she was Lara iconic, but bro. Amanda, and the two realize that they're trapped. But Lara spots oh, no. the stone dais that History gonna repeat her itself. there, and she is forced to trust Amanda as the two work together to activate the portal and Maybe teleport not. back to the temple in Tibet. Okay, Amanda, let's Lara be friends, bro. Lara looks to bro. the ground and grabs the sword as her and Amanda have a quick standoff. Oh my gosh. Amanda determines it's not worth her trouble and walks off. Leaving there you go. Lara for good. There you Lara go. If we ain't friends, leave me alone. Journal she left in the temple wow. as a child and says one final goodbye to her mother before leaving. Yo, that was crazy, bro. What is this? Under oh, yeah, they had some DLC, I think. Other adventures. Okay, I'm going to stop this right here, man, because it's going to get too long. But I just got to say, I got way more respect for Laura, bro. This video was two hours, though, so I'm going to end this up. I got a lot of editing and cutting out to do, but I learned some stuff about her. Once again, y'all let me know stuff down in the comments, but I learned some stuff. I respect her more, and I can't wait to get into, into the uh, Survivor Trilogy because I feel like what I remember from the Survivor Trilogy it didn't have half of what these games had with like the crazy mutated stuff so i really hope since they said this new game is going to unify the og with the survivor and kind of like you know fuse them you know because the survivor games were good but they didn't have this type of finesse so i'm hoping we can see that bro hopefully we can get like a trailer sometime this year something that's telling me 2024 is going to be the the year where a lot of like fire games are going to be announced that's just my intuition but hopefully it's true and hopefully tomb raider is one of the games that can be you know actually shown footage of i guess but i'm gonna end this video up right here man i hope it does well i hope y'all enjoyed it y'all let me know your favorite tomb raider game favorite tomb raider moment underworld looks very promising the first game and underworld yeah this whole storyline is freaking heat. But shout out to Tomb Raider, shout out to the creator, shout out to Crystal Dynamics, everybody, man. But I'm gonna end this up right here. I hope y'all enjoy. If you did, do me a favor, hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, hit the bell so you know when I'm posting, man. Share the content, share the channel, do all of that. I'll see y'all in the next one. It's your boy Kai SMG. Peace.